now, Miami-Dade police are still trying to figure out what led to a shooting that left one man dead and another man in the hospital. CBS 4's Amber Diaz has more from Jackson Memorial Hospital, where the victim is being treated this morning. Everybody just stopped the gun violence, man. Back in the days, we used to fight, but now there's so much of gun violence going on. It is pathetic. More than 50 evidence markers cover the ground near Northwest 52nd Street and 27th Avenue. It tells the tragic story of yet another shooting. It was a damn shame. It's a shame that this has to go on. You're hurting families. Miami-Dade police responded to a double shooting here in Brownsville around 1.30 Saturday afternoon. They found two adults had been shot. They were taken to Ryder Trauma Center. In the meantime, investigators taped off the heat food market and began talking to witnesses. According to people who live nearby, this area has become a hotbed for violence. It's like a war zone, you know, like a war zone in our own community. And, and like I told you, in less than a year, more than one person has been in the same area. But this one got me want to stay home now, and that's a shame that you can't walk your own streets. And investigators have yet to identify the two people involved in this shooting. Of course, if you have any information, you're asked to call police. At Jackson Memorial Hospital, Amber Diaz, CBS4, this morning.